What is up, guys? This is Justin, a.k.a. FMDG, and I'm here with episode number 26 of Chandler FC, a race up the United States Pyramid. Today we have FA Cup matchup against Sacramento. They're in the championship, so this one's gonna be tough. Let's get into it. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, as you can see, we are facing Sacramento FA Cup third round, and this is after beating their academy team in the National Cup 3-0 just a few days ago. Hopefully, we can take them down again. Again, I say. Different squad of the same club, I guess. These guys um, are the team that took Shimizu from us. So we're a little bit still hurt, even though basically it's a different team from then. New manager, Shimizu's gone. He's on his second team after them. Formwise, since uh, we left off, Tulsa Roughnecks we beat, as you remember, went up against Nashville SC Academy, 5-0. In fact, we haven't allowed a goal since that goal you guys saw. Um, Western Mass, who was in third place. I guess, yeah, one of their guys scored, but for us. Charlotte Eagles, San Jose, Indiana Academy, and then Sacramento Academy. Academy in the National Cup fourth round, as we mentioned. So we're into the quarterfinals for that. We are playing an unknown team. Line them up. We don't care. We'll bring them in. A transfer window has started and we've made two signings. Uh, we brought in Ricardo Medina. He's two star current, four star potential. Uh, center, um, sorry, center back who is 6'3. So that's why I'm kind of liking him. 15 determination. Um, heading's only six considering he's got a jumping reach of 12. He's six foot three. He's taller than most other people he's going to face. So that's kind of weird. The heading's only six. Maybe he misses a lot. He swings and misses. I don't know. I, I don't know. But I kind of liked what I saw in him. He's in the under 23s. And then Brian Acosta, also in the other under 23s, striker. This is someone the director of football brought in. One and a half stars, three star potential. Yeah, I think those stars might be a little off because, I mean, physicals, ugh, yeah, he's 19 years old, but he's got great finishing, first touch, aggression, which I kind of like to see. One of those guys, he can just, you know, I don't give a crap. I'm just going to go up there and score. Uh, teamwork of 14. Termination is a little bit low. I didn't notice that. It was one, you know, like I said, director of football brought in. And because it's an under 23, it sort of slipped in under the radar. So we will, you know, deal with that as best we can. We have offered some contracts to some of our big stars and not so big stars. You can't see in here, but I noticed the last window made me think of it. Brad Chan, um, he has a contract offer. Yeah, as you can see, he hasn't even accepted it yet. We um, want really want him to be part of the future, and hopefully uh, he can maintain that. We've also um, given given offers out to Penland and Fuentes and Jan Lopez got an offer. Prieto, I am not going to offer. He is making far too much. He is, um, I don't even know how I let this one happen, Six twenty-five a week. So when he leaves, I've got plenty of guys who can step into that spot and fill in for him. So not too worried about that. But yeah, so it, you know, his time is going to end. I did try to let him go and um, trying to get, generate some interest in him in the transfer market now so that perhaps maybe I can get something out of him, but no one is biting. So even though he had at one point a 240K value down to 115, I would take 115 right now. Also, one thing I've noticed is I have not shown you guys my profile in a while. I think we covered some of these things before, but I noticed something interesting in here, and that is tactical style that I uh, go for is Route 1, which is nothing, nothing like I try to do. My whole goal is short passing. So this route one, interesting, but whatever. Club vision, everything is going swimmingly right now. The contracts that we did uh, extend our guys to have been three or four year contracts. So that gets the minimum two year contracts for first team, which, you know, I wish they judged me on that because I'm nailing that. Okay. And uh, getting into the match, this is the lineup we will go with. 
everyone's sort of there. We'll see. But, you know, like I said, we're playing a championship team. We're in the fifth tier. That's second tier. So a bit of distance between us. But I'm not going to change how we play. I, we've done this before when we've played tough teams like this. Uh, I can't remember a few years ago. We, we did play, a, uh, I think, a championship side when we were a couple uh, leagues down, even lower than we are now. And they took us, took us big time. But this will be the lineup we're going with. Uh, Lopez and Gulf, Fuentes, Marky, Hamad, Jan, uh, back line, Haro and Bayreuther in the middle. Penland, Espinosa on the wings, and Prieto supporting Jones up top. Still a balanced mentality. Still going to just play our game. Let's get into it. All right, I am going to tell them to pick up where they left off before. Motivated a few. Let's get into that kickoff, and we are in our house as well. So hopefully the home crowd pushes us a little bit into a surprise win. Ooh, this is this is not good. This is this is not good. He's got a potential knee injury, Espinosa, who I'm trying to resign. Um, ah, he's needed a rest, and I should have rested him. Stupid, stupid. Okay, um, I'll work with this and uh, get back to you. Okay, this is the update I've made. I brought in a size, moved him over to attacking center, moved Prieto over a little bit. So we're going to have a little bit of a log jam over there. But uh, I was thinking about playing a size in the uh, winger position, but he's got a one for crossing and uh, I, I need this guy to be able to cross the ball. So uh, I can move him in. Uh, we're just going to see what's happening. I mean, Shadow Striker is the hot roll right now. So, I don't know, maybe bad, good things will happen. Don't say bad things. All right. Well, uneventful. There was zero highlights in that first half. Um, I didn't even see the injury happen. It just kind of came up. But XG is not terrible. Um, just both teams are not getting the ball on. We are pushing them back at actually a lot and um, I might try to widen them out a little bit here uh, let's say I'm happier performance so far I guess we'll do out search arms everyone's inspired let's go to the tactic screen let's get a little bit wider and we'll work the ball into the box play a little bit more patient um, everyone else is doing um, Marky sitting on a yellow and a 6-3 have to keep an eye on for him Right, they have a freak uh, corner kick and score. No, no, that sucks. That kind of just bounced around until one of their guys got on top of it. Yep, just got it between the keeper and the guy on the right post. No, sorry, the right back on the left post, I guess. All right, we will go uh, positive here and leave it at that. Man, losing Espinosa, that stinks. Okay, we have a highlight here throwing deep in their zone. Baruther from Fuentes back to Fuentes over to Pinland, who's going to change it way over to Jan. Come on, get past that guy. Asais over to Jan. Jan's going to look for options. He finds Haro, Asais, Pinland right at Tapia. Ah, that would have been nice. That would have been nice to get something going on. We do get the rebound, and Haro gets it back to Lopez. Over to Jan. Uh, he's going to look for options. Jones way up front, one on one. He's going to put it in. Jordan Jones. Get in. We've got a tie game. 65 minutes in. Big time. That just gets ahead of that defender. Turned the wrong way. Slots it into the left bottom corner. Smooth like butter. Smooth. I'm definitely going to show them some praise for that. But Ruther is shattered. We have to take him out at 75. Ooh, they have a highlight here. Let's do go back to balanced. Ooh. Not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. Okay, okay. Uh, who's playing better, Penland or Asais? I'm sorry, Prieto or Asais? Prieto is going to move down here. Asais is going to move over here. And then we will take him out for Gomez. I mean, I'm not going to change how we're playing. Keep going. 
All right, we have a throw in here, Jan, over to a size. Oh, I thought he was gonna get that. They have a counter, counter don't. We, we got Hamad, God, freaking awesome. Except you just lump it up for nobody. I don't know where, he's looking for Espinosa. He's gotta be offside. Wow, that wasn't offside. Okay, well, cool. Um, do need to look at getting Beiruther out of here. Let's wait for this highlight to end. Hopefully it ends soon. They have 12 guys standing right in the same spot. Assistant wants me to go very defensive. I am not, but I will not do anything here. Make a change, get Beruther out of here for Magali. I mean, we gotta go with the experience. Go with the experience. All right, immediately, uh, got a highlight here. Lopez with a goal kick. He's gonna take it over to Fuentes. He's gonna lump it up to their team and uh, give them a good shot here. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah. Uh. All started from that bad goal kick. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I don't know what. Oh, he was just, that was just a perfect pass. Perfect pass. Okay, I'm going to make some changes. All right, I've gone very attacking. Um, and oh, Haro with a free kick. Let's go get somebody's head in there. Come on. Yeah. Oh, three guys just standing there watching him, watching him run for the ball. And then he runs past us. He, he had a 40 yard run. Heads to, oh, okay, Lopez. Uh, what I was saying is move some of the guys up a little bit. Uh, went very attacking. We went more direct and that's going to do it. Ah, I'm more worried about that Espinosa injury than anything. I'm going to just, I'm going to do this. See, okay, good. I've inspired them. I mean, this is a team three tiers above us. They should beat the crap out of us and they barely beat us. So we owned them on possession. They owned us in shots. I mean, we just made stupid mistakes. Uh, I really wanted the money that was going to come out of that. I don't want to click this. If I don't click it, is he ever really injured? Like Schrodinger cat, Schrodinger's cat. One day. Okay. I can handle that. I can handle that. Just under 4K. Marky suspended a match. Yep. All right. As for coming back, I will probably do like a month, month and a half or something. Actually, I might come back um, a little bit later because now looking at this, I mean, we've got the season wrapped up, you know, wrapped up sort of. Um, I didn't even show you guys the uh, table, so I'm a horrible person. But I might, I might only do two more episodes this uh, season. But let's get into this. I can show you we are 14 points up uh, with a game in hand over Philadelphia Academy. So we are doing fantastic. Again, you know, only two draws. So I might, I do want to move this along. So yeah, I will probably play about two months offline and then uh, come back and... Um, you know, maybe two more episodes this season. All right, guys, thank you so much. That was episode number 26 of Chandler FC, a race up the United States pyramid. Um, FA Cup, you know, flailing. We, we didn't win, but that's okay. This was a team three divisions above us. I will take it. We fought with them the whole time, went a man down, uh, lost one of our best players. I mean, everything that could have happened bad to us sort of happened. And we still ended up barely losing. So fair play to us. We're the good guys. But um, we'll, I'll play, if, like I said, a couple months offline. And um, come back for a game uh, here in a couple more days for you guys. But thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day.